crafty friends this is Teresa with fresh and renewed with Teresa and I'm here for day four of my video collaboration with um, Helen who is crafty mama diaries and Letty who is party planner papery for our doodle bug Christmas collab now I want to tell you that I did miss it yesterday um, due to a little issue beyond my control um, I won't go into it in great detail, but if you're a member of my channel, you know that I had open heart surgery in t late 2022 and had to take a, an extended absence. And sometimes I just can't do what I plan to do. And yesterday was one of those days. So, anyhow, I... Um, We'll make up that day at some point. Um, I couldn't get it ready for today, but I will make up that day at some point. And along the way, I had everything all planned out of what I was going to use. I was going to use up a whole bunch of different things. And what I decided to, what I discovered as I was, I've been crafting is that if I use all those different things that I have have in my Doodlebug Christmas collection, then I wasn't going to use anything. Well, I mean, I was going to use stuff up, but I wasn't going to use up a collection or use up something. So I started with the night before Christmas, and I decided that I'm just going to continue using the night before Christmas for the rest of the collab until it's all gone. I mean, doesn't doesn't that make sense? So anyhow, that's what I'm gonna do. And that's what I used today. I used a sticker off this sticker sheet. Just, no, I used two stickers off this sticker sheet. So pretty good. I made some tags today. So, and who, who would think that it would be a good idea to not label your dies? When I stopped, when I closed my business, Scrapping for Less, and I reorganized a bunch of things, I decided I don't need my dies labeled with what company they are because I wasn't planning to do any videos. Well, now that I do, you know, I wish I had dies labeled, but I don't have them labeled. So anyhow, I used this die, I can't tell you where it's from. I used this little, um, little kind of, kind of scallop, but, and then I used this scallop. I used this little tab piece. And, um, so those are the pieces I used for my dies, for my, um, tacks. Then I want to show you this. I have this little tub that I got. I don't know. I've had this forever. And this tub is full of Christmas ribbon and some Christmas flowers that a friend made me. So this tub is completely full of that kind of stuff. So I keep this in the cabinet up in the top of a cabinet and I pull that out at Christmas time to um, when I'm making tags and, and all using it. So um, I kind of made all the tags kind of the same way. I did, um, I did a white tag and then on this one I did um, also um, use some pattern paper on all of it. But I have a little pocket because I have some money and some gift cards that I need to put in several packages. So, so on, and how I do most of my tags is I thread the ribbon through and then I tie a bow around that ribbon with some twine or some other ribbon. And if I remember correctly, I think I got this little idea from Christy Marcotte. So I'm not sure though. So anyhow, that is tag number one. Tag number two, I just left white. And then I have um, some gingerbread paper. And then I use the gingerbread house and the uh, little um, candy 
the gumdrop, and then I put the little mouse like he was, um, his little peeking out of his little mouse hole down there in the corner. And then I will stamp on the back of them to and from or write. And then I used some brown satin ribbon, and then I had that pretty sparkly ribbon in there, so I used that. Then this one, I kind of try to make my tags match my um, papers. Um, I've got some snowman papers, so I made this one out of the snowman paper that I had a scrap of. And then just put, the, these are the two stickers that I used. And this was the back of um, one of the papers, and I just cut out, die cut those two circles right there so that I could... You know, just have some interest there. And then and then there's the hole, the opening. And then I had this paper this ribbon that's kind of funky looking. And I put a silver glitter twine bow on that one. So those are my three tags today. And I will catch you in the video tomorrow. I do want to let you know that um, I am going to do a giveaway. So in, or I, I failed to mention this the other couple of days. So I am going to do a giveaway of some doodle bug products. Um, so in order to be eligible for my giveaways, when I do a, a giveaway in a series on my channel, you need to comment on every single video. So I will link each day's video down below, and then you'll have one week afterward, after the video series is over to, to kind of get all those comments in. So um, I will list all that information down in the description box below so you can check that out. And I just want to thank you so much for watching. Um, again, I am using a new setup. Please let me know. I have like, 60 days, I think, to re to maybe return this if if it's not working out. Please let me know if the, the lighting is an issue because I know you can see. I, I moved some of them, but I know you can still see them. So please let me know. I, I did have one person tell me that the lighting wasn't an issue. Um, but I would love it. I would love to know from, uh, you know, other people, please, uh, uh, you know. Let me know. So I will catch you in the next video. Bye.